In this video, we will learn how to use np.dsplit. All right, so we start IPython and we import NumPy as np. And let's create a random matrix A. We'll do six by six by six between 50 and negative 50. And we'll turn that into ints. So let's go ahead and take a look at A. You see that it's six rows, six columns, and has a depth of six. We'll do a.shape to see that, six, six, six. np.dsplit a comma three. We'll split on that last and final dimension. So now we have one, two, right here, and three arrays. Okay, to illustrate this point a little bit more clearly, let's take a look at the shape of A. And now we're gonna look at the shape of each of those arrays that we split. So for A in np.dsplit A comma three, let's print A dot shape. All right, so as you can see, it's split on the last dimension and we have three different arrays now coming from A, each six by six with a depth of two. So D split always splits on the axis equals two or the 3D dimension. So that means the number you put in always has to be a divisor of that third dimension. So there you have it. That is how you can use np.dsplit in Python. Please check out some of my other Python videos and please subscribe for more Python programming content.